channel so i'm just getting ready i applied a little bit of bb cream and um yeah in today's video i'll take you guys along um it's kind of a day in the life vlog uh, a really chatty one because i want to give you guys an update about what's happening and i feel like it's been ages since i really talked to you guys um so yeah that's what i'm going to do in today's video my skin hasn't been great i think it's because of the sunscreen um, as you guys know, my father came to visit me for three weeks um, and he just left, which is really sad, but yeah, we had a lovely time. The time literally flew by because it doesn't feel like three weeks at all. It feels kind of like a week and a half. Um, but yeah, it just flew by so quickly, but we had a lovely time. Most of our days we spent on the beach which was really nice and we went shopping so i will show you a few things that i got recently as well and um yeah i'm just gonna finish off my makeup because i see my battery is about to die as well <laughs> so um yeah i will be right back to give you guys an update about what's going on so this is my simple makeup look um i didn't apply any eyeshadow as you can see just some mascara i did my eyebrows and something on my skin and lips uh, really simple and then i'm wearing a dress uh, from primark i believe and i really like it it's quite hot still here in turkey so um during the day you can definitely still wear your summer clothes but in the evening it's getting a little bit more chilly so um if you come to turkey to marmory soon i would recommend uh, you bring like a, a summer jacket or like a long jeans or something like that for in the evening but during the day you can definitely still wear your summer clothes um but yeah this is my outfit of the day so if you follow me on instagram you saw last week i had a collaboration with lala lab i had the collaboration over on my instagram but i thought i show it also to you on here for maybe if you're interested um, but by Lada Lab you can get these photo boxes, you can get albums, prints, also photos on canvas, a lot of different options. And uh, they were so kind to send me this mini um, photo box. Um, I really like their concept, you can download their app. On their app you can upload all of your photos. And then you can choose the size of the photos and uh, they have a lot of different boxes as well and yeah i got the mini version i think the packaging is already very cute and then inside i got all of these photos you can also choose the color of the photos and also the writing and i printed a lot of disney photos but also some of our trip uh, from the netherlands last year and you can also choose if you want them shiny or matte um, so many different options and I just really love it um, you can print your memories and you can have them in a little box so yeah I'm so happy with them and they were also so kind to give me a discount code for you guys which is my pretty 20 and I will link it down below as well so you can check them out so if you're interested in a little photo box like this or an album or anything else um, yeah you can use my code my pretty 20 for 20% off and then I also want to show you two products that I got recently from Yves Roger uh, these were not gifted <laughs> this is also not sponsored or anything but I got a new serum and this is a anti-age global um serum and i'm 27 now so <laughs> i can start using some anti-age cream i think um so yeah this is a really nice serum and i used it now for about a week so i will let you guys know if um if i see any difference or if i like it but yeah i got this one new and i will link them also down below if you're interested and then I also got this new perfume and this is called Evidence. 
And this is also by Yves Roger. And this is how the packaging looks. And this scent is really floral, feminine, I think. A little bit powdery as well. And classic. I think I will describe it like that. And a really light favorite, a really light fragrance, um, which I think is perfect for during the day and in the summer as well. So yeah, I really love this as well. So yeah, I will link them down below if you like to check them out. So if you follow me longer, you know we were busy painting our house. And as you can see, um, the living room and everything was all done. So I bought off Trentul, a Turkish website, these uh, shelves. They come in three different sizes and I bought them like all together as a set. And I thought I will put them above the couch like this. Um, but that has to wait because my husband is still working and I can't do it myself. As you can see, it's very, very empty right now. So I thought these shelves were perfect for above the couch. And then I can put some uh, decoration bits on there. And um, again, if you're interested, I will link them down below. And my husband is still working at the moment. I think he has to work still about two weeks or two and a half, something like that. Um, which is of course very good because um, like I said in Turkey you work like crazy in summer but then in the winter you are free so um, yeah we will continue our projects in our home and in the winter time so then I have these nice shelves and obviously I will um, show you guys everything and then I also bought the same uh, shelves for above the bed but we're also going to change our bed soon. Um, yeah, this is our bed right now. And uh, this will be our guest bed. So we're going to put this bed in the uh, guest room. And then we're going to buy a whole new bed. And I want something a little bit bigger. Um, yeah, I will show you a picture right now. So I want something like this, I think. So yeah, if you live in Turkey and you have any idea where I can find a bed like this, uh, please let me know in the comments down below. But yeah, I just love the color and I really love these, um, I don't know how I explain it, but like the texture of it. So yeah, let me know if you have any idea where I can find this in Turkey. So what is also new in my home is this coffee machine. Um, this is our first coffee machine. I hadn't had one yet. And this is from the brands Chibo, Tichbo. I have no idea how you pronounce it. It's a German brand, I believe. Um, but yeah, it's like a Nespresso. Um, as you can see, you do the... Uh, cups in there. I will show you one cup now. This one I tried this morning, Caf uh, Cafissimo, Cafe Crema. And you have like these little cups. And yeah, it's basically like an espresso. You put them in there. And here you put the water on the back side. It's a really lovely gray color. And I'm so happy with this. Um, yeah, I tried this one. This one is also very nice. It's a espresso, but you can also use like a bigger cup. So then you have like stronger coffee um, because I'm not really a fan of a espresso. But if I put it on the middle one and add some milk and sugar, then it's quite nice. So yeah, this is also new in my home and I'm very, very happy with it. So for lunch, I'm having a sigara burek and this is filled with cheese. And then I have some um, grapes, which I really love and just some water. So yeah, that's my lunch for today. So I'm going to clean uh, my Pandora bracelet. Uh, I removed all of the charms so it's easy to clean. I use a silver cloth. Um, this one is from the Netherlands by Blocker. If you live in the Netherlands, you can check it out maybe. And this is just a um, silver polish cloth. And uh, I find that this works really well, as you can see. It's very black from the last times. And because I live close to the beach, I think it um, gets really easily black everywhere because of the salt, I guess, in the air. At least that's what I think, because as you can see, it's not that shiny. So yeah, I'm just going to clean it right now. And then I'm just rubbing it in like this. And as you can see, you can clean it very easy. And I find that this is the easiest way to clean your charms. 
And look at the difference. It's so shiny again. Only the ears are a bit difficult to clean. But yeah, I can see definitely a huge difference. Um, I know also Pandora can clean the bracelet for you. Um, only not in the weekends. But if you live near a Pandora store, you can also pop in to ask if uh, they can clean it for you. And that's totally free. So it is the next morning. Um, yesterday, after I filmed the last clip, I went to my mother-in-law. I hadn't seen her in a while. Um, I had dinner there, but I totally forgot to bring my camera. I know, I'm the worst vlogger ever. Um, but yeah, we had a really lovely evening. And um, as you can see, I just woke up. So um, I think I talked enough in this video. But yeah, if you enjoyed this chatty uh, vlog, please don't forget to give the huge thumbs up because you really help my channel with that. And don't forget to subscribe. And I hope to see you guys very soon in one of my other videos. Bye.